people, welcome back to another episode of All the Mod Expert. Oh yeah. This mod I like. I like. But there is stuff I don't like. Like villagers changing my crops. It's okay, now they're all stuck. <laughs> but uh, one thing I pretty much got, uh, you know... Hmm. I really wanted to try something because I found something. And as it turns out, it doesn't work. So let's go in here and let's go into Rotten. So if we go here, the way you can get it is from a zombie. So my plan was if you kill zombies, there's a chance you get iron normally, but they dis disabled it. They thought about it. They were brilliant enough to think about me and they didn't want me to, uh, you know, go through the system so <laughs> they actually did good so that's why i'm mad uh simply because they you know they thought about people like me trying to break the system uh so in my winter you can see that i've got a steel chest plate here and i've also got more things i've got those things here called filing cabinets i've got the mystery folder uh this i got because i went exploring and let me show you what uh, here we've got the staircase. Uh, if we go at the bottom, I, I know I should go three, three tiles, but I, I mainly don't use it. Uh, I've got a teleport at the bottom, so I don't really need to use the stairs. But for you, I will use the stairs. And as it turns out, I ended up in a mine shaft. Oh, I didn't know that I didn't light up this place. Uh, do I don't have any of those on me? But if we go at the bottom here, you can see there's some lapis array here, which is pretty cool because I can mine it. Oh yeah, <laughs> I should probably talk about the pick that I have. Uh, it's a different pick, as you can probably determine. And well, this pick is made like so. Reinforced stone, which is made into a calculator, which this is not the real recipe, by the way. Uh, I will show you the real recipe. Well, it's pretty close to this. Uh, if we go in here and we go there, uh, this is compressed couple, cobble, and this is a pile of wood. So it's four, four logs and nine cobblestone for one. But yeah, I was going here and pretty much was walking and I saw cobblestone. So I was like, oh, I know what I found. And, uh, oh, it's true, I didn't have enough space, so I left a couple of stuff here. Uh, but yes, I was like, oh, that's nice, I'll be able to make a farm, they give iron, and uh, I found out that they don't. So I was mad. But I wasn't really mad, because if we go home, oh, home, home. Uh, this is the filing cabinet. This is uh, this thing here. Uh, let me show you a little bit of what it is. I found those in chests at the bottom and uh, over there where I'm going to take you in a couple of seconds. Uh, and when you right click, there is stuff in there. So there's like, let's say this one has a rabbit foot. So when you do this, you get a rabbit foot. And well, this one has two blaze rods. Oh, you can't stack them. And this one has a diamond. And this one has a diamond. So we've got two diamonds, two blaze rods. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, so when you, you get those, you can do boom. Oops, wait, it's true. You need to open it, then you right click, right click, right click, and there. You go. So now you can close it. That's pretty cool. I I really like this thing, and uh, yeah. So that's pretty much what's new, except I've got this this armor over here. Uh, but I've got this thing here that I don't know what to do with it. The ancient tome. But uh, before. It, it's like, I don't know, it's like raining, so I can't really know. But I need to show you what I got over here. Uh, I was just going around because I continued uh, uh, exploring a little bit. And I found this thing, another spawner, but I've already prepared uh, most of the things. Uh, but it is a skeleton spawner. So I'm pretty happy with what I found because this is going to give us XP and of course bones which is amazing uh and also armor because you know pretty much give all the time armor uh i made some emerald tools also just the usual things not so uh crazy it's just i exchanged for uh, some emeralds and i got those 
pretty happy about those two. Uh, I continued making the grindstone use. Uh, I've got the like these things, but I did not melt them yet, which is something we will have to do today. Uh, but the first thing we want to do is spike. Yes, those things here. So it's nothing too complicated, just four logs, and I'm only going to need one. Uh, so one, two, three, four, and bam, at the top here, we're going to need some of those. Uh, like so. And there we go, we've got one wooden spike. What it does is reduce health to half a heart, but doesn't kill, and this is where the magic will be happening. Uh, we will also need some signs, so I believe I'm gonna go like this. Oops, that's not how you make a sign. <laughs> I, I forgot how to make a sign. Uh, I did not, actually. Alright. Hey, buddy, could you stop playing with the door? Uh, so pretty much the only reason we need a sign is because where the water is going to fall, it's going to fall on the spike, and we're going to be next to the spike, killing them. So that's pretty much the only thing that's going to happen. Oh, I almost fell down there. Okay. Uh, so this is the place they're going to go. Uh, if we go at the bottom here, so if I break, should I? Eh, yeah, let's do it. Let's put that there. If I break the water, you're going to be able to see what's going to happen. Uh, it's going to fall here, fall there, and go all the way over here. The only issue, as you can see, the floor is full cobblestone. This is because there is a cave right under us. Like, with really bad guys. Like, I mean, really bad, bad people. So, I kind of got to be careful here. And what I want to do is I want this to come... And I'm just gonna have like the pike, uh, the spike, and the skeletons are going to fall on it. So let's see. Okay. And what I believe I'm going to do is check if. Yeah, you see? Cave under. Ah, uh, this is so annoying. Let's do this so that the water doesn't come on us. I'm pretty sure. Okay, here we can come down one. Can we go down two? Uh, we could if we go here. I'm not trying to make this pretty. Uh, this is not what we're doing here. Oh. Did you hear him? Mr. Skeleton was trying to get to me. Uh, Alright, so that means that we're going to be able to do this. And over here, we're going to put down the sign. And we're going to place this there. So they're going to fall, they're going to come over here. And pretty much what's going to happen is too tall. I'm going to actually make it three. Uh, and we're going to have like a hole to go up here. Oh. <laughs> Almost got stuck in there. Uh, but at the moment, I could... Because we, we don't need something pretty... Oh, wow. I did not think there was uh, going to be... A hole right there. We just need to do this, so there's going to be another block there, and we're going to kill. Uh, of course they're going to see us, so they're going to try to shoot us. Uh, I hope it's not going to be a big issue, uh, but we never know. So, alright, let's do again Om Home, and uh, we're going to make some ladder. So we can get down there. Like I say, it's nothing special. Really, really simple farm. I'm not trying to go complex. It's going to be night, so I won't... I, I might be able to get there. Uh, one other thing I need is a trap door uh, for the top. Uh, I believe I've got a little bit more cobblestone, so let's get over there. I lit up a little bit around it so we can actually access it. Because, well, <laughs> you know, you, you want to be able to stay FK. And if you want to go back to your base, you kind of need to uh, know how to. Oh, the only thing is they're going to spawn. Yeah, I did not think about this. Uh, also, kind of need to have something here. Okay, so let's do this. This thing will remove and replace it with that. Um, there we go. 
and there we have it perfect so that kind of works but I think I'm gonna need to make it go a little bit higher uh, just gonna make sure there's nothing around yeah now there's see us I need to make the roof and everything uh, bam bam and what I'm gonna do is this perfect so now we can go down there and oh I did not think about this I should make them go lower but we can do this oh the items are a little bit too far no ah I think I know what I can do let's do this that maybe we should you know put a torch here because <laughs> it's really dark uh, what I'm going to do is this so now we can get closer so that's pretty cool uh, I'm gonna continue working on this I don't think you guys need to see uh, the whole shebang uh, like I say I might make it go lower uh, just so they don't get stuck and they can pile up over there because I'm not gonna just kill one at a time that would be uh, stupid on my part so I'm gonna continue working on this and I'll bring you guys back after all uh, of this is uh, is done Whew, that guy was close <laughs> Alright guys, so uh, I've done a couple of things, like uh, some of this thing. Why can't I take it? Oh, there we go. Okay. So I've got like a lot of it. Well, because we're going to need quite a lot of it. Well, I don't have a lot, but I think I have enough. The only thing I didn't think about was uh, we need some of this. Uh, I was thinking because we need to go into Ambers if we look in the book uh, the next thing we need to do is this thing here because we need to find Ambers a place where there is Amber and we need to make like all those things but to make this thing you need to make a compass and to make the compass you need petal dust because you can't make this one of course you can't <laughs> what do you think you need to make the petal dust which needs the runic altar so we're gonna make the runic altar and the runic altar is like so uh, and stone boom runic altar okay so we need to make I don't know rare material no uh, we need to do where is it um time shift chanted stone modifiers imbuing a staff terror spell <laughs> i don't really know how this thing works healing rooty growth powder no this is not what i want can i just no see runic tablet yeah, that, that's what i want but i don't know where to go Time shift, sacrifice, wild wood, downfall control, runestone. No, it's not what we're looking for. Living tools. It's not what we're looking for. Uh, viewing a staff. I don't think that's what we look for. Your mortar and pestle yield a fine petal dust. Oh! that's what we're looking for okay so we're gonna need uh i might need four those to be able to make uh, what it was looking in the picture or let's just try to do this yeah okay so maybe i was right you need to make this and you need to make that nope like this yes okay so something like so there we go uh, perfect you go away uh, so with this thing I, I still don't know how it works uh, it was here imbuer your mortar and pestle deal fine dust for use and spell but it can really be used on its own with this device your channel natural energy from the powder into the branch of wood simply place 
in a stick, place in your potter and wait for your staff to pop out. Okay, but how do you get the... How do you get the powder? That, that's what I want to know. How do you get the powder? <laughs> how hard is it? Just... Where is the powder? How do you get powder? The mortar. Okay, that's what you need. Okay, stone. <laughs> Seriously, this is driving me crazy. I like when things are done. You can easily understand what you need to do. Okay, we've got a mortar. Now, how do you use the mortar? That is the next question. Do you need a pestle? Diorite. I don't have diorite. Okay, using the mortar and pestle is quite simple. Detail in the tablet, there are many recipes for different spells. You need to all these ingredients as well. Create the most basic spells, simply place in the spell recipe, as well as an old root. This will allow a spell with no modifier. Okay. Uh, Terra. No. Spell. There we go! Beef, mushroom, and a poppy. We'll give petal dust. Okay, all right guys, I'm gonna go gather some materials and also wait for the night and I'll bring you guys back <laughs> All right guys, I have one uh, Just to show you the recipe. It is even more complicated than I anticipated So you need old root mushroom This this and then you hit it with your pestle and it gives you one uh, And of course they don't stack So bam, we've got one Perfect. Okay, so the next recipe to do this thing is tin and copper. Uh, I should have actually all of those. I like it so. And bam. So now you can look at this and it's going to tell you when you are in a good chunk to be able to get some amber. Uh, of course, that means I'm going to have to go run around. Well, we could probably do spawn. We'll see if there's one at spawn pretty quickly. Uh, there's nothing really at spawn. You really want to have like a high density. So you want to be like your your needle on the right side. Uh, but alright, uh, I'm going to spend a couple of times looking for a good place to do this. And then I'll put a teleport over there. And then we'll prepare everything else that we need. Alright guys, so I don't know why my game crashed when I arrived here, but uh, I'm down here. I couldn't find like higher than this. I've been looking for a little bit of time, but uh, I think we're going to place that here. And then, oh yeah, I should probably show you uh, how you make those. Uh, it is like so, with a mechanical core which need the atom pipe. Oh, and the lead, I thought it was uh, hard to do. Turns out it's not. The, the ingot is uh, doable, just smelt. I didn't know. Uh, but yeah, you put this on top, and then you need something to put the item in. So what I wanted to do uh, was I needed another chest. Oh, but I can do uh, set home hole. And do home home. Take a chest. <laughs> I know, I know, it's a little bit cheaty. And then do home hole. There we go, we're back. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so we're going to place the chest here. And we're going to place the other chest over there. So, over here. It's going to be a little bit weird, what I'm going to do. But uh, don't worry. I'm going to put an item pump right here. And I'm going to put an item pump uh, right here. And this is going to go bam to this chest, and this is going to go bam inside of here. Uh, these work with levers. They do not work if you don't have levers, so you need to activate them. And if we place, uh, let's say this, it's going to go in. And we should... Eventually this thing will work. There's 27 coal in there. Hmm. There we go. We're getting Ember Shards. And this is the thing that we need. Uh, so let's go back into Embers. Uh, and the next thing we kind of need. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. Uh, I know that about 
all of this here is good to go. Uh, so now that we get the teleport, let's go home. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Uh, we need to make an ember activator and we need an ember crystal for that. Okay, so maybe I do need to stay in the hole. Uh, we need the big one. I believe you can put six of those together to make the big one. Yeah, and if you don't think uh, this, this thing goes down quickly, it goes down quickly. Uh, so I know that there's one on this side, one on this side, one on the other, one on the other. So I'm just going to be moving this uh, in between uh, pretty much episode. But for the moment, I need to wait for this thing to pile up a little bit more. And uh, I'll bring you guys back when we can make the rest. Alright guys, so I'm back at the base. And I've got a little bit of everything that we need, so let's put like the Ember Activator here. It's pretty cool, I like the way these things work. Uh, so we're gonna place the torch there. Do I have spawns? No, oh, by the way, all the villagers are dead. I, I don't know where the zombies came from. They just killed everyone? Uh, but alright, so we're gonna put that there. So this is where the Ember is going to go. So we're even gonna see. And you can see it's there. It's looking great. Uh, we're going to have an ember emitter. We're going to put it up front. And we're going to have a melter. Uh, this melter is pretty much what melts the material. And uh, what we can do is place, I believe, you place it there. And then you shift right click and right click. So now they should be linked or you... Hmm. They should be linked, I believe. Could be wrong. Uh, but uh, then when you're going to put some uh, material in there, let's say, let's go take uh, the thing that gives iron. So the, the weird ores that we got, uh, well, that I got while I was mining. Uh, so lemonite should, in the melting, give one ingot. So let's take some lemonite. It's not lemonade, guys. It's lemonite. <laughs> and you just put it in there. And this thing should melt. If everything goes right. This thing is working. So why is this thing not going? Um. I don't believe you put it there. I believe you put it at the bottom. But let's try. Oh wait, is there like a side to this? Let's see if there's a side. Okay. Is there like an under? No. So for some reason I can't... Let's move it here. Maybe we're just uh, placing it wrong. Oh! I'm an idiot! Everything needs a lever! There we go. Now we're getting Amber. So if I place this stuff in here... Now uh, let's put like a block. We're gonna be able to see that it should be getting melted. It should melt. There we go. Perfect. So I believe I might have enough material to do the next step. Uh, this I don't need to look at the book because I've already done that thing. Uh, but what you need, you need a stamper. Like so. And you need a stamp base. Bam. I didn't think I was going to have enough material for everything, but turns out I do. Uh, we will also need... Uh, I believe I placed my things somewhere. I don't know where I placed my things. Uh, here. Perfect. So if we do bam, 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 we're going to get a raw bar stamp. And there's a couple of ways you can get this. Oh no, you can only do it in here. I thought you could do that, uh, let's do this, and let's turn this into a little piece, bam, 
that should turn it into a block. Uh, let's leave that in there. Okay. Da -da -da. And bam. Perfect. Uh, so I did remove the hopper. I think we're going to remove the hopper and place a chest instead. Okay. So these two, the ones that I'm going to do, and this one needs to talk to each other pretty much. Uh, so I need more of the Zamber thing. Uh, but let's do this. So if we do that, we place this one here and we place that one there. I think I'm going to interchange them. I think that would be the best thing to do. Maybe we place them here instead. Like so. Mm. Okay, wait, I remember they need to be placed on a block. Like so, so this is the stamp face. And again, the other one needs to be placed. Like so. This thing gets the liquid, this thing gets the power. Okay. And then you take your stamp, you place it, oops, place it there. The liquid's gonna go there, it's gonna stamp together. And yeah, that's how pretty much it works. Oh, and I need more of this. Ah, I didn't think I was going to need to make more of this thing. But it's okay, I guess. Okay, so I need more of this. And I need glass. Pretty sure I've got some in here. Perfect. Let's do this. There we go. All right. Uh, we're going to go check out the hole where we got... Eh, I could pass it on top. That could be cool. Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna pass the cable up top. I normally don't do that. I normally... Oops. No! Alright, we're gonna pass it up top, I said. I don't, I don't know why I'm going that high. I don't need to go that high. I just need to be able to pass on there. There we go. Bam! It's going in there. So we should see, there you go, there's a thousand millibucket of iron, molten iron in there. And... Uh, let's go home hole. There we go, perfect. Alright. Oops, wrong door. It's so nice to not have a villager that opens the door every five seconds. It's more like every one second. Uh, but, uh, alright, so this thing... Because the thing that I wanted to do was to put the chest here and put the hopper like so. So what we can do for the amber is put a chest with the pipes instead. There we go. Let's do this. Alright, so let's do... There's going to be a chest here. And this thing, here we go, we're, no, it needs to be one further. So we're gonna put that here, and we're gonna go, wait, I don't have one? I thought I had one of those. Huh. I keep, I seem, I seem to be missing one of each, of everything that I need. <laughs> Can I do this? I need three more glass. There we go. Let's make this. And then I need to make a uh, one of those. Perfect. Come on, let's do this. I want to be able to see an ingot. I want to be one ingot. That's what I want. Okay, let's put that here. Let's put that there. Let's put a lever. Place your amber in there. Flick the lever. Oh, yeah, I need to link it. There we go. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, there we go. We, we have an ingot. We have an ingot, guys. We have an ingot. So that's the thing I completely forgot. You need two of those uh, to to send two different places. Unless you have uh, something that's going to, you know, change its side and stuff. Uh, so this one is going... Oops. This one's going to do this one, and we're going to get another one for the other side to melt. But I'm super happy. We've got ingots. That, that's the most important thing in the world. We've got ingots. 
Uh, the thing that I'm looking for is this. Oh, I'm missing stuff. Wow. I did not think I was going to miss stuff. It's okay, I've got material. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Did you take... Eh, I'm, I'm thinking this is going to take too long. I believe we can just do... What? Oh, you can't? Oh, I believe those could, but it seems I was wrong. But all right, I think we've got some iron, so there is one thing I need to do with the iron. And it's make a bed. I know it sounds weird. Making a bed with iron? What are you talking about, Kraken? What are you talking about? Well, what I'm talking about is with the iron, we're going to make a bucket. With the bucket, we're going to be able to get the material to do bam, bam, bam. And we've got a bucket. So we're going to come here. We're getting crystal thingy doodler. And in the back here, I've already tested that crystal. It can just be put on the ground. So then we can grab it with the bucket, place a lug, and then we get wood. <laughs> so there we go. Let's take some logs. We've got four logs. We need three. We need three wool. Alright, so this is going to give me a one. So it's going to take a little bit of time. But I want that bed so bad. So bad. Okay, let's do this. Wait. It did the 16? <laughs> what? Okay, maybe I should watch what I'm doing. It did 16 in, in one little hole. Uh, okay, I pretty much need one more. So we're simply going to do it with one because we don't want to waste all of these good goodies. There we go. And bam. Oh, no, no, no. We don't want to lose the bucket. The bucket is important. Okay, so that means that now we can do a bed. Oh yeah, we have a bed. Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! We have beds. We have a bed. <laughs> uh, one thing we're gonna do is put that there, just because it's kind of annoying. All right, so we've got ingots. We've got treatment for the ingot. Well, except that now we just need to wait on that thing over there. But I am super, super happy. This thing takes time. So I'm super happy, guys. This is really good start. Actually, it's pretty much the book. <laughs> I don't know if you knew that. But it's like this part, this part, this part, this part. Uh... Well, this is going to be the next part, pretty much. Magma slime crystal? Oh, okay. All right, this is going to be the next step, I guess. I'm super happy. Soul sand, really? <laughs> but yeah, guys, that is actually going to be it for today. So I do hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you loved it, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.